Good morning, ladies. My name is Chaz, and welcome to the What If Rhino Was in My Hero Academia. So, and I'm not based on this character off of, like, Marvel's Rhino. No, this is my own different version. So, and he... Still has like, or he doesn't like mostly talk through the entire what if, so he just until he gets to like his robot form, this form. So, and I'm creating my own backstory for him so that the he can. Basically, do like my Hero Academia thing. So, yeah. And this blue guy is Charles. Or Charlie, or Char. Yeah, Charles. Not Charles Xavier, not like, his name's just Charles. And he's the smartest kid, hen, or smartest adult, but he got so caught up in his work, his mother, or his, not his mother, his wife left him, and the... They didn't, or he had no kids, and so he decides to make a program. Um, so he basically created a AI rhino, like basically. A much more high intelligent version of we all know and love. But he's more. Er, like. He hasn't released it to a public yet because the, there's some few tweaks that he needs to modify. So, yeah. Or, but he perfected it perfectly, so, right after. And then two guys walks in. And they decide... To kill him. So he's dead. And. They leave his stuff. But. Behind. But he had like two labs. So. Yeah. Secret one and. Like. The base one. So. Yeah. He basically made a AI thing as we, oh, sorry, hold on, he has a same, or actually the AI Rhino made a body for himself, the one that looks like more human and but with like mechanical body so he ends up making three more or one two three four five 
<laughs> he means seven. So, yeah. He basically went to UA to learn more about this world and become a pro hero. So he became, or he became Rhino as, yeah, it was during this, like, if, Vor Zuku became like 15 or before yeah so he gets in to UA as he or like was basically he knew combat right off the scales so he basically Like, basically, he, like, slaughtered one-pointers, two-pointers, three-pointers. And he also saved Ochako's life. And, like, he basically went and, like, went right up. Or he dodges the, like, a robot's hand. As he runs up, um, and, and as he says, or he cuts right through it like butter. Yeah. That's what he did. Because his blades are strong. So. Yeah. He's in class 1A with Zuku. And. Arrest. So, yeah, he's basically teaching them, teaching them, or, like, he, because he's a, like, the program, and he can't be jammed, eat, like, at all. He can't be jammed. So, yeah. But he can transfer his consciousness into other robots. So, yeah. Or any machine. That's a good old... So, yeah. It, he's... Let's skip the ball throw and... Uh, here... Heroes versus villains. Let's move on to USG, shall we? So, the at the USJ, or before USJ, they decide to vote for who's a class president thing, or whatever that. So. Yeah, he's basically got everyone's attention because he's quiet, stealthy, and like all that stuff. Sorry, wake me up, wake me up. So, yeah. He's basically powerful enough to. That's his only thing. Human form, like, or his mechanical, like, android body. So, 
they decide to vote for him. <clears throat> him. Because they trust him with anything. Heck. The... Momo's like or actually she was not or he's the not the only one or that or got voted for that he's also got hold on give me a moment it's where is it it <sighs> Trying to think. It was in. Did I put it in one of? Hmm. Well. <clears throat> no. Sorry if I'm. Well. Give me a moment. It was under the what if Slayer was in My Hero Academia. So, and yes, I'm putting her in there so that the it's just for like entertainment thing. So, so he is got the attention of every single girl like basically basically like because how buffed he is and all that stuff as she's thinking in her head about or so one day she actually went up and confesses to him about how her emotions are to him as he turns or tilts his head oops, sorry and yeah he was like or he's thinking okay so yeah now they get to USJ and the thing's gone crazy. So, like, when they showed up, the er eraser head and says, 13, protect the students. As right before. During his sentence, he, or, er, Rhino, who, oh, starts attacking, like, everybody, or all the villains, like, basically disabling them from using their quirks. So, yeah, and... He actually did kill the the Nomu. Oh, because how fast he was! He killed the Nomu and injured everybody, or all the villains, in about zero 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 point one second. That's fast. As, yeah. Or, not the Nomu, the... Or, let's say there's two Nomus this time. The second Nomu went and grabbed his arm. Or grabbed the Rhinos' arm. And ripped it right off. 
Oh. As everyone sees... Is them... Him... As he says... Or he in his head says... Or... He says, turn in me. As he activates his self-destruct sequence. As... 10, 9, or 10 minutes and counting. Please evacuate the area. As the racer head and, and ev all those students leave. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, Two, one, kaboom! And it destroys the entire U U S J. Yeah. With that big of an explosion, it killed uh, Nomu, and he did save like those villains. Injured villains. Hmm? He. He says. Well. As there was nothing left of his samurai self to recover. Like. As. Yeah. They knees thing and so the very next day they couldn't believe that he's actually gone until he, they hear they like came in there he comes in. As he says, did you miss me? As he tilts his head. <coughs> and. As. <coughs> yeah. They were a little bit shocked. Like. Wait. How did you survive that? As he says. I'm basically a a system mm. I can survive anything as he says in plus that was my android body I can make thousands of those if I so choose but I turn this one so oh. yeah everybody's like happy that he's back and they ask what's his name as Eraserhead says that's Rhino who oh. See that you got. You're basically a computer, right? Like. Yes. Me, I'm a hyperior to the other one. So. I can. So. He has no limit on his powers. As. They couldn't believe that the he or actually he says or he first he went to Nezu as he says hmm well 
I came to visit with you. And sorry if I, or it was blown up the USJ. And yeah, he's ex <clears throat> he explains as this is like, huh? So you did not mean to like destroy the USJ. Correct. As yeah, he he basically like then at the sports festival during the fight one or actually during the race first of all the he got first place followed by Zuku followed by to Todoroki but before we go in any further Zuku in this what if is not quirkless he has a like infinity quirk or should I say a time quirk Or infinity quirk that can never be stolen. So, 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 Zuku, it's singing, followed by Rhino, or like, first place is Rhino, yeah. So, during the fight one, him against. I had to look for it. Oh, here it is. Against uh, that or no that guy right there. The one that, so he, him and actually got, laying. Oh, sorry, so, yeah, when he got knocked in onto the, or he still was in the ring. When he became, like. He doesn't feel pain, so he became, or he does the same thing. Like, boop, I'm back. As he starts battling, and he knocked uh, that guy out over the ring. As, yeah. So, the... But when, because his suit, or his armor thing, like his, can survive space, like everything, he, so, in this what if, is kind of different from the canon, so, like, Kirigiri just, Decides to put a nuclear, or not just one nuclear, he put two nuclears, bombs, underneath this, or in the get ready room. As when he was getting ready, he could sense it. As he radios in and to ne or like a racer head or a Nezu who like anyone there as all my angel like answering like what's going on 
I don't know, but something I'm feeling is right underneath. As he basically used his, like, beam. As he pulls out a concrete thing. As he sees two bombs. As, two nuclear bombs. As he says... All Might, or Racerhead, or Nezu, please evacuate the area right now. As when All Might and the rest heard that, there's something went terribly wrong. As he, like, he basically grabbed both of them, or grabbed two nuclear bombs, as everyone evacuated before. He picks up both bombs, yeah, and ran out, and, like, to the stadium, and flew all the way to the, like, space, as he, th like, throws them. They both explode at the same time, and he gets knocked unconscious. Or, yeah. But lucky for him, it doesn't hurt that much. So, it's just like a tickle. Tickle, tickle, tickle. So, yeah. He... Sent back to Earth. Land right on a water. As even like underwater heroes like Seal had to go get him. Bring him back. So, yeah. As, yeah. <laughs> they just put him in like trying to dry him off. So, yeah. That's why he ends up I was going to say like he was dead and but he like short circuit but he ends up Or actually, he used his tracker beacon. So, only person that really gets him, or like, Seal can't go down too deep because of water pressure. But, Rhinos had went into a new body as he walks into the water under he goes all the way under the water and grabs him and he doesn't short circuit he comes out of the water as he basically looks at the Zuku them and he says or he just looks at them and he turns around and walks away so yeah and or I was going to say that, but then I was like, nah, never mind. So, but there was a submarine one that he took control. Or, no, not submarine, not, not like those big ones, those small ones. He took control, picked up, and, 
Yeah, as he says, remind me not to do that ever again. And, yeah. All my, and all of them are like, glad that he's back. So, yeah. Then he like did die from, or actually not. He didn't really die. He just, or he explains to them like. Each, like, r robot is, like, they can talk or they can do something. But the first one that you encountered, I couldn't talk correctly. So, now, tomorrow will be probably like this. So... He ends up, like, explaining how we, each one, they'll be, like, non-talking and talking ones. So they're like, ooh, <laughs> you're more of the... So, yeah, he explains in that as the very next day... He became, or he went into this body. And, yeah, he's made out of the same material as, like, what Thor's hammer and the rest of the metals knows from Asgard is. So, yeah, he basically... Walks around, or he walks to school, as people are screaming right at him, like monsters. As everybody's like, or he turns and looks at them and tilts his head. As he says, or he wrote out, "I'm, or I am not a monster." As they're like, okay. Because he says, I'm Rhino. So, yeah. Then he, like, does, like, he goes to, like, internship thing as Rhino. Or Ultimate Rhino. The... As... Everybody knows that he can't talk because he's in the... But that, that's okay. He writes down what he's saying. Or trying to say. So he ends up saying. These words. It's. As. He ends up. Getting. Like. Battled with a no. Three no moves. Because his internship was with that girl with that almost got killed by the Nomu before or or almost got killed but before or of course the Endeavor comes in and of course as he's a mechanical so yeah they see, er, and each one was a fashion. 
So, yeah, he's basically... Basically, he used his beam from his eyes, or like what he does in the movies, where like his mask thing goes down and he shoots a beams of light thing. So, yeah, he's basically does the same thing, but to the no moves brain as he runs up grabs a pedestrian or actually grabs the ling as he he tore the bat wings off of the one of the no moves as he used his own power to cook him alive. Yeah. So, now... And, yeah. He gets... Ling. Or, actually... He gets killed by the hand over his face. Is as his he like transferred his mind into another computer thing. As yeah, Endeavor and all the pro heroes sees him, but it's sure dumb luck. As a very next day, or actually, when he transferred his, like, his body thing, or his memory, he actually, like, the earphone thing, or into his cell phone. Ding, ding, ding. Hello? Hi. Did you miss me? As they hear that voice, as, yeah, it's Rhino. As they're like, huh, well, you, you are a sight for sore eyes. Hey, I'll take that as a compliment. So, yeah, so he ends up, um, Getting, like, told that that was pretty crazy. <laughs> when you have a, like, if you, if you were the, like, a system, or, I w should just say a virus thing. A computer virus. You could do a lot. So yeah. He basically mean. He could make. Ten thousands of these. He made two. So yeah. One was this. And the other was this. So he makes. Or he goes into that. Again. So, yeah. As he basically, he talks in this form, too. So he basically says, I can be really tough charger. As, yeah, he's basically tough. So, let's continue after I... Pause for a minute. Sorry about that. The I didn't want to have it to play copyright music. So yeah. So the let's continue. As yeah, he basically talks 
as he goes to a camp. Him. And he's he actually was training harder to keep up with his limit. Or he or actually he doesn't have a limit, but he's just trying not to lose his fighting stance. So he basically cracked three mountains. But his just his head. And yeah. And yeah. The uh, she you know, finds him or no matter if he was a computer virus thing. Thing or anything, she finds him so, like, cute, adorable, and, like, because she chose him, 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 to be her, her. And who's it competing against her, you may ask, is Momo Irozu. Because she needs, like, more, like, robot in her life. So, yeah. Of course, Grapefruit Kid is always respects him as a like a machine. Plus, well, with that much system, or like he, of course, she ends up. Thinking so much about him, she remembers that she confesses to him um, before, but he, of course, oh, sorry, it went up. so he ends up agreed with her. So, they were dating for a long time. So, yeah. Yeah. So... He... Got her a little present. As, yeah. he been through a lot. Like, he lost his original body. And, like, so, yeah. He basically does all that. And he also... After he his body went through or actually they took him instead of like Bakugo and everybody else. But little did they know that he can escape. So he transforms into the this, and yeah, he basically turns into like this and then into this, 
So, he ends up um, going and saving his own body from it. So, yeah. He ends up charging into battle. So, yeah, he charges right at the villains and takes them all out. And, yeah... He basically does the same thing what Rhino does. Right, am Ram Rampage. So, yeah, no pun intended. So, other than that, the he, um, or his body, or this body went back to the workshop. So then he ends up. Like, battling against all for one. Yeah. It, it's not, like, pretty. As he went toe-to-toe -to -toe with all for one, and, yeah, he's not having it. As so, he or I'm skipping the that because he actually did win by just throw or like charging up the building and going right to the sun and and. Basically killed all for one red right in and there. And then he like turned into this S as he he says, Yep, that's how we roll as they see him with fanciest armor. And, like, I'm skipping the dodgeball thing and the overhaul fight, he did it in really fast time. It ran so smooth that even, like, there was no bumps in the road. Like, he ends up flying around, and, like, he uses his powers, and he does all that in about one second. And then he did turn into Doctor before, so, yeah. And they had, or between him... And her had two children. One that has her hair. Or they both have her hair. Or and one's gonna like. Or I'll just say. All five of these were actually her. Her, like, children's in this what if because of the of Rhino. So, yeah. He doesn't age or never dies and, like, all that stuff. So, yeah, this is the end of the video, and have a good night or day, it depends on time zones. Please leave a like, share, subscribe.